Hi folks, this is Alex Fedekov. Uh, I just bought two LED chips, uh, 100 watt each, and I'm going to check quickly if they are working fine and I need to determine which contact is plus and which one is minus since it doesn't have any marks here so um, to do that I know that uh, 100 watt chip requires like 32 volt of power and I don't want to go through the long process you know to check all this uh, to do some soldering or something like that so uh, the way I gonna, I'm going to check that it's the simplest and fastest way I know I will just take uh, four 9 volt batteries and I will connect them uh, chain in a chain connection not in parallel but in a chain since they have each one has 9 volt so 9 by 4 it will give us 36 volts which will be working fine to check the chip so I'll just connect them like this minus to plus minus to plus and minus to plus so now I have four of them connected and if you'll take you know the current between these two contacts it should be 30 around 36 volts that's will work fine to check just you know this chip now uh, this chip also will work only if the polarity is correct I mean the connection minus to minus plus to plus otherwise if it, if minus will be uh, connected to plus this chip will not light so um, let's see how we can determine that all I need to do just just connect this chip to the batteries so I'll go just like this one contact I will I will uh, connect to the battery like just just this way huh. okay there is there is a little difficulty I'm experiencing there there is a plastic that's why that's why so I'll just connect like this I don't want to go through the you know complicated stuff I just insert the contact in between the the splits in the inner split and what else I need just a piece of wire just electric wire wire I mean I could have used shorter one but I found this and uh, I don't want to spend much time to look for another one so now what I'm going to do I'm gonna put one end of the wire on a contact which is in that case which is plus over here and I'll just try to you know to connect uh, oops it worked but uh, I just want to warn you folks when you do this just don't look at the chip because it's gonna be I mean the 100 watt is really bright so I was lucky just you know by by chance uh, I, I got right uh, contacts by accident so I'll show you right now look how bright it is uh, so I advise you don't look straight into the chip because it's gonna blind you for a while now um, So now I know 
this is plus and this is minus so the plus is has the plus contact in my in my case has two holes in there and minus has one which kind of makes sense minus has one stroke and plus two strokes I don't know if it, that's been uh, intended uh, intentionally made, made by a manufacturer or is it just accident but anyway let me turn it around and show you so if I will connect it wrong if connections wouldn't be the polarity wouldn't be right so I just want to show you that the chip will not light up nothing gonna happen okay I got the connection here and see there is nothing so now we know this is wrong and there is nothing gonna happen to the chip so don't worry about that again now let's connect it back again let's connect it back again like this and turn chip away from eyes this time I want to turn it around just to show you to the camera that it's lighting up okay okay this is uh, basically all I wanted to show you today um, so this is the quickest way to find out if the chip is okay working nothing wrong with this and also to find out what polarity goes to each end all right thank you for watching this video i hope it helps you when you need something to do something like this please uh, subscribe to my channel give me thumb up write your comment and if you know a quicker way how to do this please share and thank you for watching this video i'll see you in next video bye bye now